on today's episode. We're hearing some sort of horrible scraping metally sound from the bottom of the car. Now do a star jump! <laughs> <laughs> I'm Sam and I'm Amy and, and we're, we're doing, doing the North, North Coast, Coast 500. 500. So this morning we're starting in Kishon and we're working our way west and um, and then south. We're coming back inland passing a lot of locks. We're going to be doing quite a picturesque drive today. Quite a lot of driving. Um, and then we're going to come down towards Fort William and then we're going to come inland a little bit, um, explore Glencoe a little bit, and stay in Glencoe. We're hearing some sort of horrible scraping, metally sound from the bottom of the car. See, it's so wonderful. Can you see anything? Not obvious. I mean that there's nothing wrong but no. it's not like your exhaust's hanging off or anything. Ferraris. Saw those earlier. It's cloudy and a little bit wet today. Um, we're on the way to Glencoe to go and do uh, the most physical activity we've done, which would be nice in the rain. Uh, we're doing tubing down the side of a hill. like those ladies did. Now do a star jump. A bigger one. <laughs> no, because I'll fall off it. Oh no, all the midges are coming in. I'm going. Bye. <laughs> oh, we've stuffed it now. The midges are in the car. The midges are all in the car, Amy. Oh no, I see them now. Get oh, out! I'm gonna get Ian alive. Get out! I don't know what to do. Do we drive with the windows down at full speed? I don't know. I feel like they're getting me already. They're on me! I don't know what to do, sweetheart! It's got my ear, I could tell they were getting me! <laughs> all the windows down. I right, get a few minutes of this and they'll be gone. Can I close them now? Okay. We can't take any risks with the midges. The maintenance. <laughs> Instantly bad. changed into my jeans and I've got these judgmental dogs overlooking me so I'm just gonna give myself some privacy. So where are we Amy? We're at Glencoe Mountain Resort. Glencoe Mountain Resort? Yeah. And we're gonna go on that chairlift in a bit. Yeah. First we're gonna do some uh, tubing down this uh, little dry ski slope. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. Whoa. Ah. Ah. I'm struggling to get up. <laughs> That's amazing. <sighs> right, you're done? Yeah. Yeah, legs up. We'll pull the safety bar down. Oh, Thank yeah. you very Thank much. You. Lift your leg up. Oh. There we go. <sighs> you got your phone in the way of the GoPro. Oh. <laughs> you can do it up as well. Good shout. This is beautiful, isn't it? What a day. Oh, this is nice, beautiful. Did you enjoy the tubbing? I did. I really enjoyed the tubbing. We're on a chairlift. Yeah. My wobbly arm <laughs> is tired from tubing. Um, yeah, what a view. Look at this. Our instructor for the tubing said that this was his favourite part, was the... Um, As you can see, like, and there's the footpath that runs through it. So yeah. It's kind of interesting that the footpath is... Well, like, those turns look really cool. Mm. Look at those cool shoes. Talking about mine? Yeah, I'm mine. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. We're at the top of the, uh, the chairlift. Chair lift. Uh, it's the weather's it's not great, <laughs> and if we want to lift back down, we have to leave quite quickly. Um, but we've done it, and it was really good fun. The weather has definitely turned in the last. <laughs> three or four minutes you'll probably see in the time lapse um, we might even be becoming part of the cloud now so <laughs> going down's gonna be fun yeah so we're gonna head back to the lift do the tripod shake oh my tra poor trainers how dirty they've got on that tarmac track it's half finished oh, i'm distraught <laughs> lovely view there to aid my sorrow. Someone's starting behind us. Oh, that's playing bogeys. Thank you very much. We've had a great time today. It's just changing whatever it was he was changing. I'm so happy.
Stay and unstay. Welcome to our tiny home for a night. So we have a lovely log burning fire here mm. to keep us nice and warm. That'll be good. And we have this nice kitchen area which includes an induction hob, toaster, kettle, sink, and then we've got various kind of bits and pieces underneath and a small um, fridge. And then we've got the seating area on this side, um, which is actually, is actually quite a decent size, I think. And a little shelf with books, etc. if you are interested in reading or walking. Did you... We've got the bed area, which actually is quite a decent, decent size. It's got these little lights at the back. And then underneath, we've mm. got a little bit of storage as well for any suitcases or bags to get them out of the way. And then finally, bathroom which has um toilet this teeny tiny little sink here as well um it even has a shower and they've gone very much with the sort of rustic pipe um I'm just theme. about fit in there being six foot four <laughs> here we are what time is it amy it is half past midnight half past midnight it's 12 30. we are going to use this fire because it's included so <laughs> we're going to make ourselves uncomfortably hot for the reason of we can. <laughs> 